Hello everyone and welcome to my playthrough of Serious Sam The First Encounter. This time we'll be taking on the second secret level and the second last level of the game, The Sacred Yard. Okay, so welcome to the secret... holy shit, okay. I'll do the greeting in a bit. But yes, welcome to the secret yard. I have... whoa! You know what, I think I'm gonna wait... ...for these guys to stop coming at me and then I'm going to do the talking. Anyone else? Okay. Uh, I have a small confession to make. And that's... Uh, that's the second time that I've played this specific level. I discovered how to get here once when I played this game last time and that's like, I don't know, seven years ago or something like that. And I have not played this level ever since, so this will be kind of like a blind run, so I hope you can forgive that. But let's see what we can do with this. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm pretty sure... Yes. That was evil, and that was the second time it happened. Two, three, four, and five. One, two, three, four, and five. One, two, three, four, and five. Holy shit! Okay, the game really doesn't want... The game really doesn't want you to survive this time. Then again, it's actually kinda entertaining to see. Okay, now let's commit act of vandalism and get punished for it immediately. I think there's one more trap like that. Okay. Okay, we all know where this is going. Whoa, okay, that's a lot of them. Okay, anyone else here? Because I can hear... Ah, there it is. Ah, <laughs> Okay. Oh my god, you killed Binky. Yeah, I'm a bastard. One, two, three, and four. Yeah, I remember the thing about this thing about this level is that it has uh, specific enemies, uh, those that rarely ever show up in the regular game, like the Invisible Nar, like these guys over here. But also it uh, has a lot of enemies uh, that are resized, either too big or too small. Not quite sure why, but I'm not complaining. Okay, this, the shape of this reminds me of something, but I know that I have fuzzy thoughts. 
Do you figure it out? Mm-hmm. Whoa! Okay, I actually jumped at that. You son of a bitch! Okay, how many are hiding in there? Hmm. Let me out, thank you. Uh, I think I'll go back over there and pick some health. Because I know there is an armor and health bonus over here. That's one. And that's two, that's just in case. Like I said, this is the second time I played this level legit, so I really don't know what to expect over here. Hey, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna save. I don't have any bullet weapon. I mean, I have minigun and tummy gun, but I don't have bullets, so that's it. You know, I always want to have a swimming pool like that. Maybe without the deadly electrical fish, but something like that. Okay, I'm bracing myself for whatever might come next. I admit, from one side I want to explode the statues. From other side I'm kinda worried that something will pop out of them. Mm, okay. So I gotta press these, and I'm almost 100% sure that, yes, that is going to spawn enemies. And a lot of them too. Mm, too bad I didn't notice a little bit earlier, I could have used... I could have used the rocket launcher. You know what, I'm just gonna hide over here from this scorpion, just in case there are more skeletons, but it seems there aren't. Okay, where is this scorpion? Ah, oh, there it is. Yeah, I'm great at this. But at least now I have an excuse to pick up this armor. Because I had only 44 armor points left, so that wouldn't be a waste. You know what? Screw it. If the game wants to punish me for this, then so be it. I have no idea why, but I feel like this is a build up to something. Like, uh, like the game had a ton of hidden secrets inside statues like that. And now when you destroy them just, to, you could say, out of principle or out of being used to do it, The game goes like, nope, you shouldn't have done that. And we'll see where this goes. Because like I said, this is either a punishment for... Whoops. This is either a punishment for... Constantly... Destroying statues. Or it's actually a build-up and finally... Uh, I'm going to get a statue that... 
will give me something cool inside. Hmm, there's quite a lot of them here. Okay, anyone else? Because the fact that these guys appeared in such a... Uh, in such big gaps, it definitely means that it was scripted. And I managed to deal with... Uh, the red ones way faster than the game intended to. Not that I'm complaining. Okay, so let's keep going. Like I said, I know that I'm saving a lot, but this is literally just a blind run for me because, as I said, I played this level once a lot of years ago, so I have no idea what to expect. Okay, so I probably gotta go to the side arenas. Mm -hmm. Let's check how much of what I have. Mm. Whoa! Okay, please don't... Please don't do this, I have motion sickness. Okay, now we're just taking a piss. Mm. Okay, where are you? Ah, there he is! Tiny. Good god, this is so fucking uncomfortable. I'm sorry for using that kind of language, but this is just... This is just freaking awful. Whoops. Additionally, like I said, I have motion sickness, you son of a... And I really don't like... being tossed around like that. Also, aiming upside down is freaking terrible. Okay, where are you? There has to be one more guy over here. And it has to be that tiny thing. Ah, oh, there it is. A secret platform? Okay, not sure what for. Oh, whoops. Okay, I don't like this. I really don't like this. <laughs> Please don't do this. From one side I want to stick to the walls. Yeah, but from other side... I really don't want gravity to do this thing to me. Okay, and he's stuck over there, so... Yeah, I might use it to my advantage. Anyone else? Anything else? Hopefully not. Okay, so now I'm curious about this secret platform. Oh, there it is. Okay, health first. And then armor. Thank you, game. Thank you so much. And not thank you anymore. This is starting to get me nauseous. Ah, 
Ah, okay. That's the tiny guy. The big one is hidden over there, I think. Yep, he was... Okay, let me through. Thank you. He was too big to fit the door. You know what? This is a single health bonus, and there is a single armor bonus, and I'm actually curious if the game is going to kick my ass for picking this up or not. Nothing? Okay, that's pretty damn unusual. Hmm, and I wonder... Because technically that's Great Pyramid. I don't know if this is a secret or not. I remember that there was a, uh, let's say, pyramid-shaped secret in this game. Uh, I mean in this level. Or maybe it was this? I don't know. But I'm deaf. Whoa! Uh, no, don't eat half. Huh? Three, four, and five? Okay. Whoa, okay, that was mean. That was evil. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, I can count. <laughs> it goes a little bit worse with aiming, but that's just a detail. Okay. So I see that these guys are kind of scripted to just walk towards me and not notice me until... Holy crap! No, thank you. Okay, so this is the secret that I was talking about. I remembered that. Okay, is that all? Or... Technically the game allows us back over there, but... I see more enemies appearing. I wonder if there's anything behind this pyramid. Please, mister. We're not going there. You will ruin our secret. Okay, thank you. Yeah, so like I said, these guys seem to be scripted to just walk towards you. Whoa. Okay, so I'll finish the first thought. These guys are scripted to walk towards you and not notice you until you start attacking them. So technically that's a good thing, you can turn it to your advantage. And I admit now I want to go all the way around just to see if there is a plunger on the other side. Because if there is, and I can blow this thing up, this is going to be freaking glorious. One hour later. Okay, no plunger, but there's a secret health, so I'm not complaining. Wait, maybe I can just... Mm, no, I cannot. Okay, I think I saw something else over there. Maybe that's armor. Two hours later. Well, okay, that's not armor, but I'm still going to pick it up, and that's actually pretty enjoyable. All ammunition back on maximum, so... 
That's actually better than I thought. I wonder if I can... No, I cannot climb these. Okay, so I'm just gonna go back. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting, and they had to hire a new one. Okay, so all in all, it wasn't a bad secret. Okay, so now this. Wonder what this does. Oh. Okay, so I have to close the buttons, I guess. Hmm. Okay, there are platforms over there. I wonder if I can stand on this. Yes! I am so smart! <laughs> okay, so... Hey! Press down, thank you! I figure that since these buttons stick out so much, you'd have to be able to actually stand on them. Also, I love the way that Sam carries this cannon. You'd expect something this big to be carried on his shoulder. You know, considering the weight and everything. And it turns out that he's carrying it like a freaking shotgun or something like that. Okay, let's see if I can do the same thing over here with the health. Don't press. Okay. Whoa. And I'm pretty sure you have to collect these... Okay, I'm getting a little bit tired of these scorpions. I'm pretty sure you can collect these only... Mm, only before pressing these buttons because... Yeah, you won't be able to... Jump on this stuff once the button's pressed and you'll just slide off. So that's kind of clever. Okay. Mechanism has been activated for unlock. Thank you. Not thank you anymore. Okay, there should be one more, yes. Okay, so that's... That's way better. That's much, much better. Hmm, okay. And that concludes this level. I gotta admit, it's a little bit shorter than I originally thought, but uh, like I said, uh, I played this one only two times. This was the second time that I played it, so uh, I could have been wrong, as usual. Still, I hope you had fun watching, and as usual, I will see you in the next one. Have a great day!